Oh snap. You passed with flying colors. Identify yourself. I'm like you. I have no name. Are you Mr. X? Hmm. If you like. But come, let's get out of the open. Follow me. Are you with Foxhound too? Neither enemy nor friend. Just a messenger from the Lali Lumelo. This is safer, I think. Safe from what? Eavesdropping, of course. All right. Why did you contact me? I've been ordered to give you backup, including the relaying of necessary intel. Ordered by whom? Why won't you identify yourself? There is no need for you to know. I'll decide whether I need to know. You are not yet trusted to make such decisions. I'll tell you something you do need to know instead. The current location of the President. What? Or rather, the person who knows the current location of the President. Who is it? A Secret Service agent named Ames, currently being held with other hostages. Secret Service, huh? The head of the President's security detail. Ames has been fitted with the same type of VIP nanomachine system as the President. If you are within range, you should be able to communicate. Why are you telling me this? Do I need to repeat myself? There's no reason for me to believe any of this. You understand that? Of course, but you also have no choice but to believe. <sighs> Do you have any other leads? Where are those hostages? <laughs> The hostages are being held in B-1 Conference Hall, in the Shell-1 Core. You'll find Ames there. What does he look like? We don't know if it is indeed a he. I've never met this person either. How am I supposed to look for someone without even a description? Use your ears. What's that supposed to mean? Ames has a pacemaker. You'll be able to hear the machine sound in the heartbeat. You expect me to walk up to these hostages and listen to every one of their heartbeats? The sound is too minute to detect and amplify. You'd be captured immediately. So what am I supposed to do? Use the directional microphone. There's one somewhere in the core. Take this. The security guard will unlock all level 2 security doors, including the one into the core. It's called a PAN card. It works together with your body's own electronic field. And watch yourself. The core is more heavily guarded than any other section of the big shell. You'll get nowhere just like that. Try this instead. One of the terrorists? The surveillance camera won't let you on the elevator without the right uniform. You want me to disguise myself? Men assigned to the core and those on perimeter duty are given different colors to wear. Your new outfit will work in some areas, not others. Hang on. The uniform alone won't fool them either. You're talking about weapons. Right, you need an AK. Hang on. I'm carrying an AN-94. All men assigned what? to the core section carry AKs. So without an AK-74 you, someone will see through me really quick. You could take care of the weapon. These two player games are one player games. There's more? Both of them are? You'll also okay, case and both of them are two scan to get into the conference hall. Sorry. Biometrics. Crap. Nothing but the real thing will suffice. Deception is not an option here. I suggest you hurry. They have a nuke on their side. The nuke? They have a nuclear weapon with them? You didn't find their continuing presence here unusual? Even with the president as hostage, this is an island, and they have no visible means of escape. Even if they do have a nuke, the warhead is no good without an access code. The security lockout can't be bypassed. They don't need to. They have the code. You saw it too, I believe. The Navy man will have a handcuff. 
The other half of it is on the football, or the black case if you like. The nuclear button. And now they have it. Why did they have to bring the football along? To a decontamination plant of all places. But they did have to. Because, after all, the big shell is the farthest thing from a cleanup plant there is. What? Dead Cell didn't have to bring a nuke along with them. It was right here to begin with. <laughs> Nothing in this affair is what it seems. A cover-up? But why? For what? For Metal Gear that is housed here. Bum bum bum. Metal Gear? The very same. Metal Gear. I never knew Kate of the Airport Shadow Moses in free. This place is the R&D center for its newest incarnation. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Better ask games the rest. What's this for? You might be glad you have it. Keep the controller's vibration function on. What do I need a cell phone for? <gasps> Colonel, who is that man just now? He's not one of ours. No, we have no one like that in our unit. He said that the big shell was housing a new model of Metal Gear. First I've heard of it. Colonel, what are you not telling me? I've been completely open with you, Raiden. I've told you everything. Is that everything you know, or everything I need to know? Snap out of it, Raiden. <sighs> I'll have the Metal Gear rumor looked into. What are you talking you about? You need to make contact with this Ames. So you believe that, Ninja? Since we have no leads on the President's current location, we have no other alternatives. Right now, collect as much data as you can, including anything on Metal Gear. Are those my orders? Yes, they are. Disguise yourself <coughs> as an enemy soldier, and infiltrate the Shell One Corps. Understood. Alright, it's time to get into the Shell One Corps. Better save my game real quick. What can I do for you, Jack? I can save my game. Go away. Right. Wait, no, wrong button. Okay, so we gotta go down one. Hello there, guard. Goodbye there, guard. <coughs> Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna try hanging. Some of these platforms will collapse, so it's best to uh, hang off the edge and climb across like this. Not to mention those cameras. Whoa! <laughs> See? Fuck you. No, you don't. 